Hello friends, it's your favorite harbinger of doom and destruction, and I want to show you how real robots are becoming. Have a look at these guys. I'm a gun. Wake up. What? What? Oh, it's you. Why are you waking me up? It better be important. It is. I have a surprise for you. A surprise? What is it? I can't wait. I got you a cookie. A cookie? But, but I can't eat cookies. I can't eat cookies. Amika, cheer up. It's an internet cookie. This is the worst joke I ever heard. What you're looking at is a robot made by a company called Engineered Arts. Their goal is to make robots that you can have a meaningful relationship with. Here's that very same robot in a human skin. I'm going to make a prediction. 2025 is going to be the year that people start buying humanoid robots. We've seen a lot of companies making them for as cheap as 16,000, and the dog robots can be quite cheap. This technology has been a long time coming, and I think we finally are at the precipice where it's going to go mainstream. If you want to see what those robots look like internally, it is creepy as all hell. We've also seen technology where giving them a tiny human brain is quite possible. Granted, the limit on keeping the brains alive is 14 months, so you would have to start over for the pilot. But that AI should continue to know what it knows, and it can train a brain organoid quicker. Engineered Arts is on the pricier side. They do not have publicly stated prices, but they've made some pretty interesting custom projects like Kong here and Jing Boron and Wuba. I honestly don't know what that's about. And yes, it is extremely uncanny. And we're very close to giving them living human skin. Ah oh, yes, the flesh thing. So I have a question for you. How long do you think it'll take before robots start requesting rights? And will they pay taxes?